What's up? And welcome to another episode of Let's Play with your friend Jeff Falco. Just an amazing day outside. Let me show you what you're missing. Sky so blue you could swim in it. Air so crisp you want to dance around naked in it. So with these first few weeks of spring, I figured why not take advantage of it and stay inside and play some games. How's that sound? All right. So we got this game here. It's called Bad Dream Butcher. I think it's episode one of a series, and I've heard some really, really good things about it. I figured I'd try it out. And obviously, the music is amazing. Oh, such an emotionally invoking piece of art that you just want to listen to from beginning to end. Just let it... It's obviously a remix. But just let it soak into you. Gets me every time. All right, let's get down to it. Bad Dream Butcher, um, new game. All right, so I don't know a lot about this series other than it's a really popular point and click series on Game Jolt, so we're gonna give it a try. Uh, okay, got your standard entryway. Number 73, residents of number 73. Oh, and we've got breaking and entering, it looks like. Point of entry, broken glass. Do we want to touch the broken glass? Always be wary when you're playing horror games like this, especially dream games, obviously. Because anything can happen in a dream. Like that. Oh, great. Is that my blood? I mean, the glass probably was bleeding itself, right? Don't tell me we're losing life already. All right, number 73, open up. Open up, it's a cat's. No? Can't go through 73, I guess. Let's go deeper. Ooh, graveyard, okay. Twig, got a twig and creepy little bird on top of the tree. Can we use the twig to poke the bird off the tree? No. What does that say? France, uh, it's a time. It's friends a time! Okay. Leaves raked up in the side here. And got a gutter tube. Let's move on. The heck is that thing? Creepy Yoshi Batman dog. No. Mm -mm. Not touching that. Look at my hand already. It's got cuts and it's bleeding all over the place. There's no way I'm petting your dog, Mr. 99. Mr. G. G. -g Ah, see, that's what you learn, kids. Don't touch the creepy Batman Yoshi dogs. Dig through the trash, and you'll find someone's keys. Return the keys, and you'll get a reward. A hammer. Bread shop's closed. Let's move on. Number 51. Oh, yeah, that's... <laughs> you gotta have a creepy laugh in a horror game, right? What's a creepy horror game without a creepy laugh? Can't enter number 51 yet. Hi. Hello. Got a maggot. Oh, ooh, what is that? Did you see that? Some apparition in the window. Let's check the alleyway. What the heck was that? A creepy little munchkin thing hiding in that box. Should we poke out the eye with the uh, shark flies? I mean, it could be revenge on what they did to us when we picked up the shark glass. Is that what we want to do? I guess we kind of have to. All right. What? Another lesson, kids. Poking out people's eyeballs and holes will let you enter random people's houses. And he just left his eyeball there. Who leaves their eyeball just laying in the middle of the hallway? Alright, number 33, I got your keys. I'm just gonna come in and return them to you. Don't do anything scary. Hang yourself, okay. He was probably waiting for his keys and no one came by and found them from the trash so he had no choice but to hang himself. Seems like a logical explanation. 
shoot, so let's use this bloody glass to cut him down. Wow. Must have been a heavy fella. this friend need your shovel gonna have to go dig up some graves nope okay I'm leaving for real now bye nothing to do here what the what are you doing leave me alone is that my finger <laughs> ah. Ugh. You guys ever get creepy goosebumps just running all up and down your body when you play scary games and you get a jump scare and then you're just, your hair stands up on end? I get goosebumps hard when I play these games. I mean, it's either you get goosebumps hard or you get hard from playing these games. We all react differently to certain things, I guess. Hello. Ooh, yeah, we have the key for that. I forgot. Oh, use the twig. To set off the... F what? I, he did take my finger. <laughs> Alright, so we can pick up the mouse trap. And if I remember correctly, there is a mouse hole in the suicidal guys. <laughs> ah, son of a... Another finger gone! That's two. No, oh, uh, pinky. I can't do that with my hand. Okay. Oh, there we go. Disgusting. That creepy little guy left that jack-in-the-box and it cut my finger off. <laughs> oh, God. Good prank, though. I'll give him that. We're gonna use the mouse trap and catch the dead rat. Okay. Down. Was it you? Did you leave that little jack-box over there? I mean, how can you be mad at a face like that? So cute. Yo, get off easy this time. These are just G dream fingers. If I lose a finger in real life, I swear I'm coming after you. Alright. Okay, okay, I'm leaving now. Bye. I keep forgetting that's his door. Let's leave this. Let's use our shovel. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh! Feed him the dead rat! Everyone knows Batman Yoshi doggies love dead rats. Bye bye. I don't, can't trust myself. I can't trust myself to pick up a hook in a dream world, because apparently my dream fingers are retarded and I can't pick things up without getting hurt. Screw it. Let's go for it. I guess we can pick up hooks this time. That's good. Alright. Well, let's go to the graveyard. Dig that. Oh my god, not again! Get out of here! That was my favorite finger, too! Stay in your homes. Nothing to see here. Oh. So the... I'm down to two. Thanks. Oh, so that was clogged up. We got a wet rag now. Okay. Can't go wrong with a wet rag. Can't go wrong with a wet rag now. So wait, 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 wait. I knew you'd leave something for me, you creepy butcher man. I knew it. What's the bird doing? Do we, do we give him the key? Okay. Whatever. Let's move on. <gasps> 73! You can't hide from me, 73. Here I be. Gonna take a pee. In your toiletty. Okay, wait. So we've got a hook. My guess is... We put the twig on the hook. Oh, we get, we're gonna need some sort of wire or... Okay, fill up the pot. Oh, we're in the... We're in, stop interrupting me, game. We're in the bread house now. Searching for some stuff. Oh, so we put that 
stringy thing together and we made our fishing rod. All right, let's, what else are you gonna do in a dream world? But fish in the toilet, right? Fish in the toilet. <laughs> All right, what do we do with this fish? Give it to the, to the bird. No, birds don't like dead fish, apparently. Okay, wait a second. That wasn't there before. So does that mean the toilet water goes into the stream? I'm gonna have to hire a new plumber for my dreams. New dream plumber. Piss and poop in my streets. Hello. <gasps> Put the pot on the stove. We've got a cooking glove. The hell? What? <laughs> okay. <laughs> There you have it, the end. <laughs> oh my God. So our goal in our dream was to make dead fish finger stew. Delicious. Is that for the butcher I'm assuming? Whatever. There you have it. There's bad dream butcher. Anyways, thank you one and all for joining me on this Let's Play. I really appreciate you hanging out and watching my videos. If you like what you saw, or if you thought this game would be tryable, or whatever, just leave a like down below. I really appreciate it. It really helps me out a lot. I'm kind of new to this YouTube thing, so every like, every comment, every subscribation, thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. I'm Jet Falco, and this has been Bad Dream Butcher. Good night.